Are you ready? Always. Always. <laughs> of course. <laughs> Hello everyone, this is Guru and welcome back to my channel. Uh, today I have Valentina and Fernando with me and currently we are studying in St. Thomas College, University of Cambridge. The motive behind uh, shooting this video is giving a little glimpse of how life at Edith is like. So please introduce yourself. Hello, I'm Valentina. I'm uh, a third year, come on Fernando, <laughs> I'm a third year PhD student and I'm working on the history of pre-Islamic Arabia. Uh, Hello, so my name is Fernando Perez, I am from Mexico, I do a PhD in engineering and my subject is um, the usage of superconductors in electrical machines. So what departments are you at? Divinity. Engineering. Right. He's in engineering, she's in divinity and myself guru, you know, I'm doing electrical engineering PhD second year. I came in Cambridge in 2018 in October and I'm based in electrical engineering department in West Cambridge site, which is a research division. and. How's, how's your life in uh, St. Edmunds? So far, it's been great. I've been here for three years now. Um, I cannot complain about anything really. Great friends, great place, nature, right. buildings, so art. So, um, did, did you choose this college before coming here? No, I did an open application, like yourself. Oh yeah, <laughs> mine was your friend as well. So, yeah. did you choose the college? Uh, I actually didn't. I selected two other options, but I was like, put in the allocation system and I called into St. Edmunds. So how was your first impression of St. Edmunds? Um, so one of the first things that I noted is that this is one of the only Catholic colleges and I happen to be Catholic so for me like that's that was a, kind of a like thing. a good combination yeah. and then so one thing that is very convenient for me is that my room is practically uh, above the chapel. It's not really above but like besides it. So when right. I wake up on Sundays then I can just go into the mass and that's like quite um, useful because I don't have to walk and I can be in the mass like almost every Sunday so it's kind of easy to like fulfill that responsibility. Oh that's great because it's, yeah. yeah it's the only Catholic college of Oxbridge I wanted to. Oh wow I, yes. I'm not sure yeah, like because I'm not Christian. Cambridge and Oxford. Yeah but that sounds great because we have Sunday mass and we see quite quite a good crowd yeah. every, every every Sunday. And we have uh, free coffee after the mass which is very convenient to wake up. I think they have brownies. Yeah, we have sometimes brownies, sometimes cookies. Yeah. Ah. I didn't know this and I lived here for three years. Yeah. Uh, so I'll probably sh be shooting another video where I'll be doing a little college tour. So also you get to see other faces of the college, but these are um, two of the most popular people Dinosaurs. in college. <laughs> yes, <laughs> yes, of course. Especially yeah. here. Yeah. <laughs> Valentina is a star, honestly. And I think I have another video with Valentina a uh, year back where she talks in detail about her studies, her activities she's doing. So anything you're particularly involved apart from academics in college? Uh, uh, not at the moment. So I was doing rowing on the first two terms of this year, but like that didn't continue. And um, yeah, it's quite exciting. I think it's a very nice activity to do in the morning because you see the sunrise and then you have the opportunity to interact with a lot of people that probably you wouldn't normally otherwise. Right. Yeah. Entity for, for the arts in college, president of Dead Boy Society, Film Society and Painting Society with Gurashish here. Um, I was the president of the also of the book club last year, but this didn't work this year. Right. Um, and what else? Are we I, part of the PhD Society as well? Where we had the wine yes, and cheese? Yes, the PhD Society, yeah, sure. That was pretty lit. Um, yeah. yeah. Yeah, absolutely. That's good. And then the what pantomime, else? I think. The pantomime. I wrote, um, wrote and co-starred in the pantomime, um, which was directed by Maria Khan, the great face of Saint Edmunds, <laughs> very famous one. Um, and what else? And you've been with the Maybell committees as well. Oh, two Edmunds. years, both years we didn't have a Maybell, but let's not start about that. Um, complications. Complications. Yeah. Uh, collateral damage. Um, what else? Uh, yeah, it's probably no better than Oh, I've been the representative of the Divinity Faculty last year, not this year. And you supervise undergrads. Oh, and I play the best sport in the world. Oh yeah, what she does polo. water polo and she's <laughs> super great. And any advice you want to give to your incoming freshers? Uh, well, Fernando can definitely answer this one. Since well, I, I need one <laughs> advice each, like from both of you guys. Well, I would say, first of all, start with planning uh, your moving here as soon as... Well, 
early as you can. Yeah, uh, start and with we get to have everything in market, so don't bring unnecessary stuff from your countries. Yeah. Because why I'm saying countries because in eddies we have a lot of international freshers. They move with loads of stuff, which is not required, including me. I did move with like I'm from India and lots of Indian stuff, which you really get in all the markets here in UK. So don't bring unnecessary stuff. Just bring your favorites, your clothes, and a little bit of personal belongings, and you get everything in uh, England. And Fernando, would you like to give um, so advice? So I think Cambridge is a very nice experience, but I think um, because there are so many activities to do within the university and in the city, it's very important that if you are a new student that you plan up uh, to which societies you sign up, so that you choose how to use your time efficiently and yeah. to like combine it uh, in a very good form with your studies. Yeah. And also, it's very important that when you get here, you have good communication with your tutor, and if you're doing a research subject. Uh, to also have good communication with your supervisor because uh, they need to be informed of how you are progressing yeah. and it, like it's for your own like well-being that you make this kind of um, good uh, relationship with them so that you can get the proper help that you need when you are here because yeah. uh, Cambridge is also quite challenging and if like... Oh, Fernando, you're scaring them now. Okay, it's fine. No, but I, okay, I, but the I advice is what? Well, bike? Yeah. yeah, so, it's, it's so he recommends getting a bike because bike is the safest and the easiest way to get around in Cambridge. Uh, I know some people won't like, but they prefer walking, but bike saves a lot of time. So, thank you guys for joining me today. Ready? Uh, what? <laughs> no, I'm kidding. Okay. <laughs> I like spending time with you, Guru. Come on. Yeah, but I'll be shooting at the video with. We live together. She'll be in the link. Yeah, we live together in Mount Pleasant. So I'll give you. I'll be giving a nice college tour with. You'll see Valentina hopefully soon. Thank you for joining. See you soon. Oh.